Speaking in Rome on Friday morning, President Macron did not disguise his disappointment at the public letter shared by Boris Johnson on Twitter the previous evening. One that recommended France take back all migrants that illegally cross the English Channel to reach British shores, amongst other proposals. Je suis surpris des méthodes. I'm surprised when things are not done seriously. We don't communicate between leaders via tweets or published letters. We're not whistleblowers. Come on now. Allons. In his letter, the British Prime Minister suggested that an agreement on returning migrants to France would discourage people from making the crossing. His proposals come in response to the deaths of 27 migrants in the Channel on Wednesday as they attempted to reach the UK. Johnson's letter has infuriated the French government, prompting Interior Minister Gérald Darmanin to inform his British counterpart, Priti Patel, that she was no longer invited to a meeting that he's holding on Sunday. Boris Johnson's spokesperson said on Friday that the Prime Minister did not regret sending the letter and was taking the issue at hand very seriously. Both the Prime Minister and President Macron have a shared recognition of the urgency of the situation we're both facing. And you'll see from the tone of the letter, this is about deepening our existing cooperation. The meeting, aimed at resolving the ongoing migrant crisis in Calais, will go ahead with officials from Germany, the Netherlands, Belgium and the European Commission. Wednesday's fatalities have deepened animosity between France and the UK, who are already at loggerheads over post-Brexit trade rules and fishing rights.